Hi, I'm Rod Gammons from Motorlight. We're here at Celebro Media Studios in London, and today we're going to be talking about the revolutionary Rotolite Anova Pro. The Anova Pro is a unique LED light, one of the most powerful on the market, up to 7,200 lux at three feet. It's also one of the most color accurate, achieving an overall color rendering accuracy of 95, CRI of 95, a TLCR score of 91, and skin tones of 99 out of a possible 100, making it one of the best lights on the market. One of the things that's very evident from looking at the Rotolite Anova Pro is that it's been built with real quality in mind. It's made at Pinewood Studios England, all of the components are manufactured in the UK, and it's a really, really quality product. And the soft round shape gives you a very flattering output of light. You get a beautiful signature catch light in the eye. The light wraps nicely, you get one uniform shadow, as opposed to some of the harsh shadows that you can get with square or rectangular lights. Now the Rotolite Nova Pro is a bicolor light. It's adjustable from 3150 Kelvin all the way up to 6300 Kelvin. And we're able to actually display the Kelvin on the back of the light. Now that's a real advantage. With a lot of LED lights nowadays, you have the ability to change color, but it simply says warm or cool. You have to guess what color temperature you've set the light to and your white balance. With this, it displays the white balance on the back of the light, the Kelvin, in 10 degree Kelvin increments, so you can achieve a very, very accurate white balance and therefore spend less time in post-production trying to correct that color later. A fixed color daylight model is also available, which is the brightest in the range and is ideal for photographers who are concerned with maximum light output and also for those who primarily work outdoors. Now, in addition to that, we're also able to adjust very quickly brightness. This light is truly flicker free. We don't use pulse width modulation at all. This is one of the few LED lights that's been approved by Phantom Flex for up to two and a half thousand frames per second. So if you are doing any slow-mo uh, video or even high speed photography, this is a really ideal uh, light source for you. Now, whilst the Anova gives you up to 7,200 lux in brightness, it's also one of the most energy efficient. So other lights on the market would use typically 100, 110 watts per hour uh, to produce that kind of level of output. We only consume 48 watts of output, which means on a standard 95 watt hour battery, you're running for at least two, two and a half hours, which means for location shooters, less batteries, less kit you have to take with you, making it very portable and flexible. One of the really unique features about the Rotolite Anova Pro is that it has a suite of cinematic special effects, Cine SFX, which can be a very powerful tool for any production. Included within that are things like lightning, fire, TV simulations, and all of those are simply accessible from within the Cine SFX menu on the light. Within any of those effects, you can simply pick the effect you want, select your rate of flicker and minimum brightness level, and you're ready to shoot. It eliminates the need for expensive flicker box workflows and hours and hours of setup time. For stills photographers, one of the really unique features of this light is something called flash sync. With typical strobe lights, some of the issues with those can be that you have uh, high recycle times, meaning that once you've had a flash of light, it can often take up to three or four seconds for the strobe to recharge to be able to give you another burst of light. The problem with that is if you're doing anything with movement or you're doing a wedding, it might mean that you miss that perfect shot. The advantage with this is that not only is this a continuous LED light, so you can shoot what you see, but if you find yourself in a situation where you need that bit more power, in flash mode, the Rotolite Nova Pro is able to output up to 150% of its normal continuous light output, but it does it with absolutely no recycle time at all, and with no loss of power on subsequent recycles. This is also the first flash in the world where you can adjust the color temperature to match your ambient lighting electronically from within the light itself. One of the other uses for the flash sync port on the light is we're able actually to trigger any of the cinematic lighting effects using that port. I can simply use a nice little wired trigger, put the effect that I want into trigger mode, and then three, two, one, action, that effect is ready for me on cue. I can also use a wireless flash trigger, which can be picked up inexpensively to trigger any of those cinematic lighting effects on set. You can use any flash trigger receiver with the PC sync input, but for best results, we recommend a high speed sync trigger and have particularly found the Photix Odin 2 to be an excellent option. The Rotolite Nova Pro also has a unique feature called True Aperture Dimming. This allows you to simply tell the light what ISO you're shooting at, what shutter speed, and how far is the subject from the camera. I simply enter that information onto the back of the light, my shutter speed, my feet, and the light now calculates for me my f-stop. 
meaning that I don't need to meet it on set, saving me a significant amount of time. For many shooters nowadays, particularly if you're shooting on DSLR, if you're doing a production, you want to create a nice little smooth fade out. Of course, you could do that in post-production. Many broadcast cameras, however, feature an auto fade button. So for those DSLR users who don't have that auto fade functionality, we've added something to the light called designer fade. Very simply, you go into the back of the light, select the number of seconds you would like, anything from one to 12 seconds, decide whether you would like the light to fade down or up, hit your fade, and the light now fades down for you, saving you time in post-production. The Rode Light Nova Pro comes as standard with six filters. Three diffusion filters to soften the subject and make it easier for the subject to look at, but also three magenta filters. The filter mounts very simply. We have three locking pins on the front of the light, and a gel filter holder, and the gel simply slides straight underneath. The Rode Light Nova Pro comes as standard with DMX, with a V-Lock battery plate, and a USB port. There are also a range of optional accessories available, including barn doors, a Chimera softbox, a honeycomb louver, a V-Log battery range, and a protective flight case.